Hi guys, in this video, I am going to discuss about how to write a SQL query in MongoDB database. So, add here, if I am going to use the command prompt, and if I write add here, Mongo. So, Mongo is a connecting add here, it's connected. So, add here, connecting to Mongo. Now, here, after, if I write a uh, uh, query like uh, select a star from so, uh, the table name employees. So add here uh, syntax before uh, this kind of uh, error I am getting. Okay, let's write syntax. So this is the syntax kind of error. So add here first I am going to uh, show you the table set. So first uh, let's uh, connect with uh, Adam database. And uh, it's a uh, switch to Adam. Now here after the next uh, thing is I am going to show you the tables. So add here right. So tables. So uh, this is the tables. Now if I write at here select a star from employee E M P okay E must be in capital letter. So at here oh, MongoDB all letters are, are case sensitive. So again I am getting this kind of error message. So uh, we cannot simply write to uh, or uh, any or uh, SQL query in command prompt using MongoDB. So for this we uh, need to uh, we must have two editor. First is or uh, studio 3t for mongo or here so add here no booster sql server but if i used add here or uh, uh, no sql uh, no sql booster if i go to the or uh, there so uh, this is the things and you select a star from employee so add here if i execute so add here or uh, select is not to uh, define this kind of error message okay this is inside now uh, here select is not defined a stack uh, i'm getting error okay execute uh, this query so at here see or uh, that means um mb run sql query so run sql query here after uh, select a start from employee here sort to limit 100 so that means so uh, uh, inside uh, uh, in no sql booster it provides so one uh, beautiful features there you can write a uh, editor uh, like uh, SQL query add to this editor. So this is the ready-made code. Uh, uh, there is the MB run SQL or you can try use add here on uh, Studio 3D. So add here you must uh, uh, first I'm going to connect so here localhost. So it's a uh, connecting now selecting the database add up. Here after inside item, these collections are there. Now here after, let's uh, click on uh, SQL. So SQL editor, it's uh, open. Now here you can write to uh, any kind of SQL query. So let's write uh, select uh, a star from. So select a star from going to use employee. So if I execute to this query. So whatever the contents inside employee, so it's a displaying. So see at here E, EMP, EID, and here this all contents, it's a displaying in and here. And here this is the employee ID. So this contents, or whatever the contents inside here, that's a displaying. Or you can or select any other or collection. So inside MongoDB, we are saying uh, collection, but if you're using uh, uh, SQL Server, so there you have to or tell or table. So add here selecting EMP tables collection. So if I execute, so it's a displaying EMP tables contents. So this is the EMP number here, E name here, job, and here NGR. Now here after you can do some filter condition add here by using where clause. So add here select a star from EMP, and uh, here let's write. Uh, or uh, their clause and in their clause add here their e so it must it all must be in kept capital letter so emp number and here filtering 7499 7499 so if i execute to this query so see at here only 7499 uh, row it's a display so uh, this is the editor where you can write to uh, any SQL 
or query. So first you have to select the database. Here after go to uh, SQL and here after you can find uh, this editor. So at this point you can write uh, any kind of query. So it uh, uh, std 3 d for Mongo it provides this kind of uh, uh, features that you can write or you can uh, use add your no boosted SQL. So here you can also get uh, open a new SQL query tab. So there you can write the SQL query. So I hope guys this video is helpful for you. So now in this video it's over. So thanks for watching. See you next week. Thank you.